Warning, I, Dan Lanks, am going to completely blow your mind during this Minecraft video. So if you enjoy console Minecraft, hit that like button and subscribe for more block placing awesomeness. Hey, what's up guys? It's Dan Lags, and I am back again for a long-awaited episode of Subscriber World Showcase for you guys today. In this video, I will be taking a look at some of the builds that you guys have made in my Subscriber World when I open it. And let's get started, I guess. So, quick disclaimer, if you want to be a part of the Subscriber World, get a chance to build in here. Uh, just follow me on Twitter. I usually announce when it's open, um, when I have the world open for people to build, and... I uh, usually do it on the weekends, so yeah, that's pretty much it, and let's go ahead and get started. So, right off the bat here, we have a house that um, is now finished. Last time we toured it, it was undone on the inside. So, uh, this house was built by TraumaSwag90, so we're going to go check it out. He told me the interior is now completo, so let's go take a look at it. Um, okay, we got our nice skylight over here. Actually, really enjoyed that natural light. You can see the sun, it looks pretty. And over here, um, you know, we have a little space. You could probably put a little desk here or something, but that's okay. We're not going to judge. Nice TV space, you know, like comes couches and stuff. Some sugar cane. That's all the all the rad with that's rad stuff, I guess. I don't even know. With uh, modern houses, I guess. And right here, we got a little bit of griefing. I don't know what this is all about, but you know, I'll try to patch that up or something. Here, I'll fix this for you, buddy. Uh, there we go. Even though that's probably not the best fixed job but whatever it, it works and then what the heck what is this okay apparently he didn't want anyone to go in this room but i'm in here anyway so looks like we got like a corner tv or something like that. i guess if you look at it from a distance it kind of looks like it's not in the corner because it's like it's dark but interesting idea got some nice couches and i guess it's like a small bedroom here's the bed right here all right so that's pretty cool it's over here got some more sugar cane so pretty cool by Trauma Swag. He's missing the kitchen, but that's all right. It's a modern house. They go after you because they're that rich. All right, so let's continue down the street. There's definitely some houses that are done around this area. Um, this one is not, I can tell. Uh, we've toured most of these before, so let's continue down the street. Uh, we have some, again, some more houses over here in this lot that are unfinished. But we'll get back to those when, when they are indeed finished. And that is a, that's a derpy looking... I don't even know. Willow tree? <laughs> Interesting. Um, let's see. Let's fly around this area. There's some houses over here. We'll go check out that stuff in a minute. Look at this ravine. That's cool. Alright, so over here we got some houses. And it's like someone actually put a street down here. So that's cool. And we got ourselves a nice little house here. Looks pretty fancy. Not sure why there's a record there, but there is. And uh, we got basketball hoop, we got garages, we got a nice pathway with a mowed lawn. Oh, okay, here we go. Got some comments, uh, blank sign, I guess I'll just get rid of that for you, bud. Uh, we got some stuff, I actually came here and wrote cool a couple of times ago. It was built by PMG Wolf, he's got a YouTube and a Twitter, if you want to check that out. PMG Wolf's house, yeah, okay, so let's go inside. Uh, I'm not sure if it's done on the inside. Um, yeah, it doesn't look like it's done on the inside yet, it's still got a lot of space to fill. See what's over here. This is like the porch. Check the upstairs. See if that's done. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. All right, so we'll come back to that later. Um, and here's the garage. All right, so he's got a nice car in here. <laughs> My old car. All right, so um, where should we go next? Over here. We got another house here. And this one is pretty crazy. So let's check it out. It says you missed the you're missing the kitchen. Great design, PMG Wolf. Interior not finished. Girls don't play Minecraft. Oh, here we go. Nuclear Zebra. Yes, I'm a girl. No, you're not. Girls don't play Minecraft. Oh, I see. Someone's been messing with uh, Nuclear Zebra here. So we're not gonna, we're, We'll leave the uh, feminine stereotypes out of this. So let's check it out. Um, we got a room here with a Xbox and a gaming setup. Again, she said the interior is not done. So we'll get back to it. Uh, again, little waterfall pool design. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. And we got a staircase that goes up. Storage space. Uh, here we go. Just having trouble with that staircase. Got another empty area. Oh, here we go. Now we got a bed. That's cool. And then this is, I guess, leads out to the balcony. So we can have a nice view of the subscriber world land from here. And, oh, there's actually even more places to go on and up. So here's the top floor. Cool window design, actually. So is, where, is this where you access the pool? Maybe not. Maybe you have to go all the way up to the roof to access that. 
All right, so we have a rooftop a little lounge, and I guess these are the waterfalls. You can just take a boat and swim off into the pool. Interesting to try that out. But all right, let's continue, guys. Um, we got a basketball court over here. This must be like a little tyke suit because, I mean, I'm only two blocks tall, and I could probably slam this home like I'm LeBron James. So let's continue. Um, we got some unfinished wooden house right here. We got some stuff over here we can check out. It looks like we have a mansion going up right here. Let's check out the signs. Created by King Corzell. So amazing. Krat123 wrote that. Pretty sweet. No pun intended. Oh, because he's got a cake, I guess. For Swag for Life 11. And, you know, pretty pretty cool looking so far. It's going to be humongous. I like this ice design. That's kind of cool how it's floating there. Interesting. Some sugar canes. So the interior is actually getting worked on, so... This is looking pretty fancy so far, I will admit. You got a huge, huge plan, floor plan out here, and this is, this is cool. Oh, this is really cool. You got like a waterfall going off into the pool. That's a great idea. Kind of reminds me of, um, I don't know, something that would be like you'd find in like a, like a bathhouse or something. I don't know, but that's cool though. Um, let's see. Let's check out some more stuff. Over here, we got some some stuff. I'm pretty sure I toured most of this already. I'm almost positive I toured all this stuff before. Um, yeah, we got, just got a lot more modern houses. This one's got a cool front yard coming along. This one, I'm, I don't think I've toured this one. This one was built by Cod Sniper 69 or wait, 69 or 96. Sorry, I don't know why I wrote that backwards. Um, you know cool inside i like the uh, snow on top of the the um what's it called the jungle wood because the jungle wood looks like it's sideways even though it's not so that's cool definitely a good use of that might have to steal that so we got a nice uh bedroom bathroom let's go upstairs fly on up here more stuff in here what's in here so we got an office space and then there's even more up here I can get my way up. Yeah, so we got a lounge up here and a pool. So rooftop pool, that's always a cool idea. So great job by Cod Sniper 96 we got another house right here. And I gotta find the entrance on this one. Is it over here? No. Oh, oh I remember, I remember. This one has got like a, uh, yeah, here we go, piston door. So yeah, it opens up like that. So that's pretty cool. It also turns on these um, lights. So that was really cool redstone work by, uh, by the guy who built this. Basement, not done yet. So we're very wooden, pretty cool. Lots of neat shapes, cool colors. And uh, yeah, so let's check it out from an aerial view. I don't think it's completely done, obviously. Not a lot of houses get done because, you know, it's hard to build and furnish an entire house in like four hours. So that's usually how long I keep it open for, around that time. So right here we got a candy house or something. I, this was, I think that's what this is. Yes, here we go. Modern Candy by uh, DHG Guzo. Guzu. Sorry, that butchered your name so here we go we got a little house made out of candy i guess and uh i guess this is like the portal of candy land or something <laughs> that's pretty awesome it's creative stuff right there all right so let's go back out um what else do we need to tour before we finish this up let me just fly around make sure i didn't forget anything oh yeah we got some more stuff down this road right here we got a nice cool thing by swag x4x life 11 with yeah, I think I said that right. <laughs> and uh, no, we got a little modern house here, so that's cool. And there's the garage, I guess. That must be out on a drive because there's no car. Obviously, interior not done yet, so we'll come back to it. Across the street, we got ourselves a something that's not modern for a change. What? No modern house. That's a shock. Built by I Krizik Medieval House. I love it by Lieutenant Cheesy. Great detail by Nuko Zebra, and I wrote cool place. Because this is most definitely a cool place. Very medieval. I like it. Except that's really creepy. I wouldn't want to go to sleep with that. <laughs> Severed heads next to me. It's like a little bit creepy. But alright, that's cool. Great job, middle medieval house. Obviously, that's that looks just medieval to me. So that's great job. Great job, great stuff. Let's continue touring some other stuff. So, got a modern house right here. Derp by Hype Jinx. Pretty really, really, really derp, lol. So we got modern house again and you sneak through here to get to the bedroom walk through the sugar cane this is a cool area it's got a nice view of like the area and he's got like a 
a road right here, which uh, we'll check out some of the houses on this road. Actually, there's only one house on this road right here. But before I do that, I'm going to go to sleep. So let me see if I can get into this. This always happens to me. I can never sleep. Just let me sleep. Let me sleep. Should be like, oh, there we go. Should be like GTA when you can just go to sleep in the middle of the day and it'll, you know, you know what I mean? To save the game or oh, whatever. Let's just continue. So here we go. We got another house here. Um, lots of cakes and stuff here. Very nice. King Corzell. I wrote great house and of course, got to underline your name with the snow. Love it, Nuclear Zebra. Amazing Nanos 123. Made by Lieutenant Cheesy. Help from Dan. Nah, that's nah. He didn't, I didn't get it. I didn't help him. Yeah, I don't know what he's talking about. So, um, you yeah, know, cool interior. Everything's looking fancy. And he, of course, he's got it downstairs. This area is cool. It's got a TV. I like that TV design, actually. That's pretty nice. Uh, sugarcane, of course. You can't have a modern house without sugarcane. Uh, oh, okay. Here we got a hallway down here to bedroom. He's got an Apple computer and a mushroom on his table. Nice window view there. It looks pretty sweet. Jump back through here. Here's his garage. So there we go. We got a house by Lieutenant Cheesy. And he actually started building another one. Actually, there's an ent exit right here. Yeah, okay, I didn't see this. Yeah, so this is actually, this leads to another house he built down this way. And uh, he did a really cool job. He actually built, like, several houses in, like, the same, like, area and kind of connected them with these bridges. Pretty cool. Pretty cool idea. A couple modern houses. Definitely, definitely some cool stuff that we got here. So, again, the view by Lieutenant Cheesy. And it's not finished, obviously, but... You know, nevertheless, it's looking pretty fancy up. Oh, and here we go. The uh, inside of this area is, is pretty much finished, it looks like. Cool stuff. Definitely some cool stuff. Here's a bedroom. Again, cool window. So let's go back down the stairs because there was another way we could have gone. We could have gone through here. And this leads down to the basement, which is actually like over top of a ravine. It's not done, obviously, but we'll check it out from the outside. It's actually pretty cool. I'll show you guys what it looks like from the outside if I can actually find my way out of here. Uh, okay, how do I get out? I'm so looking for, you know what? I'm just, I'm just gonna sneak, I'm just gonna grief my way out. There we go. I'll fix that later, don't worry about it. <laughs> All right, so, um, oh, you know, I just realized the door was right here. Oh my goodness, all right, sorry about that. So I'll fix that later, but um, again, here we go. We got this ravine and he's actually just starting to build these little like outlets off of the edge of the ravine, which is pretty, cool cool stuff cool ideas and this ravine is just humongous if you broke through this river thing but yeah um again he's got a cool pool area i like how he used the ice to kind of outline it. that's a cool idea and again I, I guess he's continuing this bridge idea and he's gonna make another house right here so if he ever comes back in this world he's gonna build something like something even more so this is a cool idea cool design by lieutenant cheesy and we're gonna wrap this up uh we got a volleyball court here I guess it's one, zero to one, I guess. And that's pretty much it, guys. So thanks for watching uh, Sub Showcase episode. I don't even know what episode it is, but Sub Showcase nevertheless. And uh, guys, if you again, if you want to contribute to this world, follow me on Twitter. And uh, if you get lucky, you might be able to be the first seven people in because, of course, there's limitations on Xbox. You can only have eight people in the world at one time. So um, again, it's usually on Fridays, sometimes on Saturdays, and sometimes I can't do it at all. So um, just follow me on Twitter and you'll know for sure. So that's pretty much it, guys. It's been Dan Lags. Click the like button if you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Uh, obviously, great contribution to this map, guys. You guys are awesome. Great builders. And I will talk to you guys on the next one. Also, sorry if I missed anything. Uh, it's hard to show everything because there's so much stuff to show. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys on the next one. Peace out.